This recipe is perfect for Mother's Day. Simple enough so that the kids can help and absolutely delicious. You will be needing coconut biscuits, melted butter, cremora, boiling water, condensed milk, lemon juice, some honey and seasonal berries to garnish. We're going to crush our packet of coconut biscuits. I'm going to be doing this in a food processor, but if you don't have one at home, just pop these into a pick and pay bag and just bash it with a rolling pin. Works just as well. And then we're going to add 50 grams of melted butter. And we're gonna make sure that this mixes through until we have a fine crumb for our biscuit base. This shouldn't take more than a couple of minutes. And this is the consistency you're looking for. If there are a couple of big pieces, never mind. We're gonna push it into the dish anyway. This will go into your pie tin, and we're just gonna push down using our hands. Just wanna make sure that it is as even as possible. You can even use the back of our spatula and just work it into the corners. And this is going to go into the fridge to set while we prepare the rest of our mixture. So now we're gonna get moving on the exciting and tasty part of this recipe. And we're going to add our 250 grams of cremora. And then our one cup of boiling water. Quite an important part of this recipe is that you ensure that it has all dissolved properly. And once you have what is almost a milk-like consistency, we can proceed to add our condensed milk. You're gonna be needing two cans. We're gonna mix this really well until we have a beautiful thick gooey consistency. And then we're gonna be adding our lemon juice, of which we'll be needing one cup. The lemon juice is just going to thicken this mixture and also help it set. The key is also to not add this all in one go. It's to add a little bit at a time and stop when it really is thick enough. And it's already starting to come together nicely. And you'll start to see how beautiful that is looking. The sweet, the sour, perfect for Mother's Day. And that is ready to go into our tart dish. Our base is set and we're ready to add our Kimura mixture. This mixture's looking so delicious, I'm ready to tuck in right now. And once again, just using the back of your spatula, we're just going to move this from left to right, up to down, and just get this to fill the corners. One last time in the fridge and we'll be ready to serve. Our tart is ready and set. This will usually take between two and three hours. If you're a little bit more organized than me, overnight is even better. And if we give it a bit of a shake, you can see we're ready to garnish. Just get some strawberries, pop these into quarters, and this will just add a little bit of color. First, I'm going to drizzle with honey. I love that gold contrast against that pale cream of the condensed milk and cremora. Add some raspberries. And then because I like a little bit of extra sour, just some lemon zest to finish. That'll just about do the trick, and this is ready and perfect for Mother's Day.